When we saw this happening, that's because racing is returning to Lathrop with high speed and power, and the track is not made of asphalt or dirt. Instead, it is on the water. Alan, how dangerous is this? Is hydroplane racing? Well, I can't. I don't know if it's so dangerous because here's the thing: nine-year-olds can do something like this. So that's going to show you there is a lot of safety wow. out here. And Terry. That's what you guys, obviously, first and foremost, Terry, uh, when it comes to Quake on the Quarry Boat Race, if safety is number one. Safety is number one. It's a family sport. We have an ambulance out here. We have divers. It's all about safety. I think it's way safer than probably being on the Delta or a lake on a weekend. We all know each other, and we are one big family when it comes to racing. Uh, and $10, you can bring a carload of, of family, and that's it. You don't have to pay anything else. There's no other up fee or up charge or anything like that, and you get some awesome racing action all day. You can actually bring your picnic basket, bring your lawn chairs. It's Ten dollars to get in. We start officially at eleven o'clock today, mm -hmm. and then we'll be running until about three o'clock. Uh, now there's different classes. I mean, we're to, first off, we're talking about nine-year-olds. If, if you're, is there a kid out there watching? They can get information here on how to start their passion. They can actually take a test ride. We have a test ride program, so if they want to come out here, they can come out here for twenty dollars, and we will put them in a boat uh, for a test ride. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> That is so much fun. Oh, that is so cool. And weather-wise, I think today was even better than yesterday. Yeah, yesterday was a little bit windy. All of our guys pretty much kept it on the water, but yesterday was a little windy. Today is supposed to be absolutely beautiful. But I would probably tell you to bring an umbrella. It could sure. be a little toasty out here. A little toasty. Bring your umbrella. Bring some water, of course. And we're not right next to, across the other side, is Del Osa Farm. So if you know where that is, where they do the the uh, the pumpkin patch and the corn maze, that you know how close we are right off of I-5 itself. Now, if for some reason someone we can't make it out today. You got a long list uh, of different events, not only here but around the uh, uh, Sacramento area. We do. We'll be back here in August. We also will be at Lake Minden, which is Nicholas, California, in August. Uh, we will be at Oroville in September, and then we'll be back here the very last weekend in October for our final race. Oh wow! Look at that. Look how fast they're going now. Is there kind of like a speed that they go? Is it miles per hour? How do you figure out? It's everybody has a speedometer. It's miles per hour. These guys are about 68 miles per hour. Oh wow! And they're on their knees. On plywood, hand on one throttle, other hand on the steering wheel. Oh wow, that is uh, that's it takes a lot of technique. And what I love about this, I've only been here for about uh, 30, I would say 30 minutes, hanging out with you. Everybody's so friendly. There's no like you know mean competition. Maybe on the on the water, but here everyone's helping each other out. Well, yesterday we actually had a driver go over. Boat got boat got wet, engine got wet. His entire class was who helped him dry it out, so he'd go back out and race oh. with them again. We also have second and third generation families out here racing. I see brothers, I see, you know, fathers and sons racing with each other and, and next to each other. Oh, yeah. So uh, my husband's out there right now, uh -huh. um, so he's racing. But, yeah, you have father, in fact, you have a father and son out there right now. So we have, <laughs> so, yeah, they, uh, it's, it's a great it's, sport. It really is. It's so much fun. Oh, my gosh. Check it out. Again, uh, it's officially open at 11 o'clock. And what time does it go to? It will go to about 3 today. About 3 today, 10 bucks a car load. That's all it is. Dang. You can just pay for your parking, and you're going to see action like this. Come on. I love it. I know. I love it. If I didn't have to work, Alan, that is where I would be today. So cool. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, we had Looks fun.